<clears throat> no action yet. So basically what I've done, but uh, I've taken away the barless hen. She's in one of my pigeon boxes in the shed. I've gave her some water and some food and she's been in there for one day. Um, I'm hoping to keep her in there for one or two more days longer and hopefully that helps them, Leo, um, pair up with this hen. Uh, I'll see how it goes. If that doesn't work, then I might look at building um, him and Storm their own separate um, villa outside somewhere like a quite a big area for them because i do want to try and breed a few more rounds off them um and get more of those their youngsters in this loft and flying around because they are definitely better oh this is promising this is much better see how he's popping his wings like that he's definitely showing that he's more interested We'll give them some food anyway. That's a good sign. Hey, you behaving yourself? Let's see if she hops down. Come on, hop down. Hop down. Come on. It's hard to do one hand that. Come on. Hop down. No, you're a bit shy. That's not like you. Come on, you two, get this show on the road. Oh well. I don't think these ones here are doing much either. Tiger Grizzle's looking pretty good, aren't you? Still um, keeping an eye on her. I'm assuming it's a female because she's not fighting with the other cockbirds and they're not fighting with her. Um, we could actually test something. Let's test something. Sometimes you can, I used to do this with, um, Johnny used to do it and then also Cheeky used to do it as well. I could put him in with any pigeon and he'd straight away tell me if it was a male or female, he'd either try and mate with it or he'd try and fight with it. So it was pretty simple. I thought this one might do it because he's a bit more, um, similar to those two where he doesn't want to breed or fight everything, but yeah, not much happening. I just want to know what that one is well I don't think that is going to happen anytime soon with those ones. So, looking promising with these two. He is starting to, he's 50-50. He's he is calling because he misses um, the barless hen. But at the same time, he's starting to forget about her a little bit as well. So long as I keep her out of here for a little bit longer, and then I can get these two paired up, then we'll be good because they are my favourite two pair. Um, and then I just want to try and let them breed over the winter here. Winter here is not that cold anyway, so pigeons can breed winter, summer, any time of the year where I live, so it doesn't bother them. And for me, it's not a huge issue because I'm not really racing at the moment, so it doesn't matter what old age my birds are. Um, I'm hoping to get some out of these babies out the block flying around in a new loft, so 
good breeding for me. Anyway, I'm going to catch you guys later. That's just a little quick update. Um, if you think that I should build Leah and Storm their own little penthouse outside where they're undisturbed, there's heaps of room, um, and I can just let them breed, drop some comments down below. Hit the like button. I'm going to see you guys later.